Raising the sunken South Korean ferry could take several months. Four large marine cranes are currently deployed in an effort to raise the sunken South Korean ferry seawall and bring it to shore. The seawall is 146 meters long and was carrying 2,000 tons of cargo on board when it sank. The vessel alone weighs 6,825 tons, but could weigh as much as 10,000 tons with the water it took on when it capsized. The ship sank in waters up to 37 meters deep. Four marine cranes will be used to lift the vessel. One has the capacity to lift 8,000 tons, two have a capacity of 3,600 tons, while the fourth can lift 2,000 tons. It will take between 15 and 20 days for divers to position chains around the ship, after which large buoys will be used to help lift the vessel as cranes turn it over. When the ship is lifted to the surface, water will be drained from the vessel before it is towed back to land on a floating deck. In 2010, it took one month for workers to recover the sunken warship Cheonan, which was five times smaller than the ferry and had broken in two.